Hi guys, so it's Tatiana here. Um, it's week 36 and 37. I can't remember the last ones I recorded. <laughs> um, I don't think I did week 36. But then we just make sure. Um, so, let's see. Week 34, yeah, 36, 37. Okay. So week 36 and 37, I've been, um, I've been really good, thankfully. Um, I haven't had any, um, any of the hormone drama that I had before, like that's completely gone. I have some energy and I feel like, I feel like I feel great, you know, like I'm, I'm ready for the baby to come and I'm just anxious now for things to happen. And, um. I know the last video I told you that the blood came out and I'm, I was, you know, one centimeter and all that. And um, I'm still, I mean, I'm still pregnant, obviously. <laughs> um, but I, uh, I just went to the doctor today and I am three centimeters. And um, I'm still having like these breast and hicks contractions, but no real contractions yet. So, um, yeah, it's just, just the waiting game now to get her out, and I'm really anxious for her to come out. <laughs> um, I keep thinking every day that she's going to come out, um, but uh, yeah, she doesn't. So, it's beautiful here in Pennsylvania. There's my husband. <laughs> um, it's beautiful here in Pennsylvania, and I've been enjoying the beautiful weather. Um, it's been a little hot but I will take it. <laughs> this winter has been awful. So I'll take the beautiful weather. And, um, you know, yesterday I posted on Facebook my skirt. So I've been able to wear a skirt. I have a short, shorter skirt on today, um, but I'm still sweating <laughs> my butt off. Um, but I, I hear it's going to get a little bit cooler throughout the rest of the week, but I'm really excited to oh, finally have spring here and enjoy a little bit of it before the baby comes. Um, Baby's room's done, and uh, um, I posted those pictures also on Facebook, so if you want to see them, you got to go on Facebook, <laughs> and I'll post the link below to that, um, and you can see it in the photos um, there, and also on Instagram, so I'll post my Instagram link uh, below as well, so you can go on there and see the pictures of the baby's room, and uh, one, I'll film it after the baby's born, um, if you guys want to see it here on YouTube, but... Um, as for right now, you guys can go to my other, my other links. Um, what else? 37 weeks. Uh, I'm still not exercising, but I'm still very active as far as doing stuff, you know, around the house. I'm still doing the laundry, still getting stuff done. I'm in the nesting mode, so I just want to get everything finished. I'm actually, after I'm finished filming this, I'm going to go clean out my car, um, you know, vacuum it all out and wipe everything down so that we can get the car seat in there <laughs> and get the stroller in there as well. Um, cause we do have that set up and we're excited about that. And, uh, yeah, so, so far so good, but I am, uh, again, like I always say, I'm still drinking my shakes. I've been drinking them every day religiously and they've been super helpful for me and, uh, especially the chocolate because it's been, I feel like that's what's been helping my hormones, like, lately, you know? Like, I've been able to um, keep those crazy emotions down. Um, I am swollen. I had to take my wedding ring off. I told you last time that I was thinking I had to take my wedding ring off, and I did. But I do have my anniversary band cheapo ring that I did get. Um, actually, I got this ring um, because my original ring had broke and I had to get it fixed and I didn't have anything on my finger and I felt uncomfortable not having anything so I bought this one for like 20 bucks but it's doing the job right now so you know it's a little cute little band um so because my fingers got so fat <laughs> I'm like let me go get a pedicure so I got like a french manicure and the same thing with my feet my feet have been super super swollen so I went to go get a, a pedicure um did I say pedicure twice? I meant manicure, pedicure. Um, and it was so nice to get this pedicure because 
it was like a hot stone massage pedicure. Oh my god, it was so nice. And it was only like 25 bucks, which is unheard of. Um, so I'm really grateful that he took the time to do all that. And um, it made me feel good. It was so good I had to come home and take a nap. <laughs> so it was like one of the best like uh, pedicures that I've had. Um, and so yeah, I've just been trying to like relax at night and night I just you know I, I um, work on my business a lot which I enjoy um, you know my beach body business as a coach and uh, we have a Brazil butt lift group that started today and I'm so excited for the girls to start because I just I know how excited I was when I first started and um, you know doing day one and and then drinking my shake and then you know from day one to day 30 like seeing the difference uh, in my body and just the energy that I got and oh I'm just so I'm just so excited for them so um it's going to be an awesome group and uh, and I think uh we have T25 starting May 1st so that's going to be exciting too um for the girls to start the T25 um so yeah that's all really that's been going on oh I I also had a dentist appointment today and I got my teeth clean just to get that done and over with so I didn't have to do it, you know. Um, I don't have to worry about it after the baby. And my teeth are great. Still no, uh, well, you know, my gums were a little bit, like, bloody. You know, like, you're just, during pregnancy, your gums get really, like, they get really, um, uh, you know, soft and, and sensitive. And so I bleed a lot when I brush my teeth and stuff. So it's good to get your teeth clean during pregnancy so that way, um, it helps with that because I think you're really prone to um, infection if you don't keep your teeth clean during pregnancy. So, um, but everything's good. No cavities. I've never had a cavity in my 32 years. Knock on wood. <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah, she, they said my teeth look great. So I'm really happy about that. <laughs> um, that's it. That's all that's really going on. You know, we're just waiting now. It's all just the waiting game. So I'm praying that this will be my last update to you guys. And then the next update will be the baby being born. And that would be really exciting. Because <laughs> I'm three centimeters now. I'm like, she has to come soon. She has to. I mean, hopefully 38 weeks will be the week. If not, then I'll update you next week, hopefully. With the 38 weeks if I'm now that I'm off of work I did I am done Saturday was my last day and um, I just couldn't be on my feet that long anymore it was really a lot I, I couldn't believe like how much it was you know to um, be on my feet that long and <sighs> being a hairdresser is tough like you're on your feet for like four to five hours at a time and you gotta like stuff in food in between and it's, it's, it's a really demanding job um and you know even like people who have to women who have physical jobs like it's it's a lot and god bless you guys that do it all the way to the last week but it, i took i wanted to take the last two weeks to just you know be home and and just enjoy the last two weeks of my pregnancy if it is going to be two weeks who knows but anyway i will update you if there's any changes and thanks again guys for following me and following my journey and um you know contact me if you have any questions i'd love to answer them for you if, you know with anything that i'm going through or if you have any questions um about what you might be going through and i can you know maybe answer something i don't know but um i'd love to interact with you guys and um and thank you so much for all the interaction on facebook too i like you guys make my day every day and it's been an awesome time to share all of this with you so all right i will talk to you hopefully next week bye guys talk to you later bye